Other than HTML, you can also export reports in CSV and PDF formats. Choose a test suite report. Export report. Here I go for CSV details since it has more information to look at. Click open. You can view the CSV file using Microsoft Excel or any IDA like VS Code. It provides a very simple report. In the second line, you can see the overall information of the execution, including the browser environment, description, tag, start and end time, duration, and most importantly, the status. Here it says failed, indicating there's one at least test failure. Below, there are four sections matching the four executed tests, each separated from one another by a blank row. First line of each section is the test case name and below are the executed steps. Looking at the status column, you can quickly spot that this second test failed at the checkout step. That's pretty much for the CSV format. Let's move on and export a PDF report for this very same test suite. Here it is. The layout is quite similar to the HTML format, right? The headline is the test suite name, and there are environment details and a summary of the test suite execution, including the list of test cases and their status. The next pages are where you can see the particular report of each test, including the test name, its execution status, the main details of each test step, and the status. Similar to the CSV report, the second test is imported as failed. Scrolling down, you can see it failed as step 5. Unable to set text of object, along with a screenshot of the browser. The other tests in this suite are both good, both fast. What about the test suite collection? Can you export CSV or PDF reports? Well, the answer is no, since HTML is the only option. And that's the end of this lesson. In the next one, we're going to show you how to send Calon test reports via email.